So we're down to the uh, physical setup process, which is also very easy. You need to have your my ditto, um, your Ethernet cables, of course, and you have need to have it plugged. And you also need to have your um, wireless router here. So uh, first things first, I am going to plug the my ditto to the DC port, and then plug it to my power strip. Then I am going to plug the Ethernet port down here to the LAN and then plug it directly to the router. Um, I know some people are wondering, is this wireless? It isn't wireless, but the, the thing about it is that because you want to have the best signal strength and you want it as close to your router as possible, so you it's best connected wire to your router. Hit the power button. Let me just flip this around so you guys can see. And there it is, it's on. Of course, the router isn't plugged on right now, so you're not getting any signal, but with that, you will see the LAN on and it will show your status. And then if the USB key, key is in there, it will actually tell you a key is in there. Um, <clears throat> I believe so. So you can, if you plug in one of the keys to the front USB port, Okay, so since the system is not on live, we won't get that. But we'll get to that in a second, and then we'll go through the whole setup process uh, of copying keys and, and doing that, which is also very easy. All literally you have to do is you plug your key into a USB port to the front port. Sorry, one second. And then you hit copy, and that will copy uh, the driver settings for the My Ditto to your USB key. Take that out, travel with you and plug it into uh, your laptop or friend's computer and it's done. Thing about it is, is you can actually use any USB for copying your MyDito key. So, uh, so I have my MyDito uh, connected to my real router. That was just a demo router just to show you guys. And you, you can see all the indicators are on. You know the power indicator is on on the top. A LAN is on, blinks a little. The status shows solid. USB 1 is not fully lit because there's nothing plugged to it. USB 2 is because I have a hard drive plugged to it. And HD Bay 1 is on because there's a hard drive there. Bay 2 has nothing. So I'm going to take my USB key. I'm going to slide that in. And you can see USB Bay 1 lights up. Now I'm going to hit the copy sound button for two seconds. I'm going to hear a beep for two, after two seconds, beep once, wait, and you hear two beeps to confirm it's done, so. First beep. That confirms you've copied all the drivers, so you pull it out, and we install on the computer. I have my, my Dita USB flash drive. I'm now going to connect it to my laptop here. Windows is going to install software, recognize your device is ready to use. And then you go, this is Windows 7, so you go to open and view files. And this is my Ditto apps, my Ditto auto run, my Ditto application. Click on the my Ditto application. Now, I have to create a username and password. Um, so I'm going to create a username called Thunder E. Uh, password, I have that all set. Hit OK. And there you have it, I'm in. So now I can see, of course, this, that's what's on my desktop, it's on the right. It says C users. On the desktop, I have a few applications there. And on my left, it has two hard disks, which is off the my dear. One, disk one, is the uh, public shared Thunder disk, which can actually have stuff to share. Um, this is the whole interface. Uh, we'll go through the whole interface setup in our review, but this is just the whole setup. And disk two, disk three, actually, um, is the ex external hard drive I've plugged in via USB and we are good to go. They the idea and we'll go through the whole my review 
uh, and show you how you know things work and all that fun stuff so I uh, hope you guys liked it uh, that's how to set up your my Ditto. it's very easy it's very simple like you see all you have to do is connect it to the router copy the drivers and plug it in and you're good to go and you can uh, basically watch and stream from anywhere um, in the world or in your house so there you have it thank you very much again this is Thundee if you have any comments any questions let me know uh, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube page Facebook Twitter all the fun stuff so this is Thundee from Waterworks team thank you and always enjoy entertainment